Let's see some live data ingestion through Logstash to Elasticsearch and some monitoring through the Kibana. So here I have downloaded the Logstash 5.4.1 tar zip file. Uh, let's enter it. Okay. Now I'll go to the bin directory where logstash file is there. So I'm going to create a conf file here itself. You can create it anywhere. logstash twitter.conf. So today what we'll do is uh, we have a live cricket match going on India versus Sri Lanka. So we'll try to get the live tweets uh, with the hashtag INDVSL and uh, try to ingest it into Elasticsearch and see how things are going on. So let's get started. So this is the conf file and uh, I have the uh, configuration ready here. Uh, this is the Twitter uh, consumer key, secret key and token where you have to register and uh, create one app in the app.twitter.com and uh, you will have these credentials it's pretty simple and this is a keyword which I'm using INDSL and uh, these are the uh, elastic search details and it, the name of the index is India pretty simple configuration file so this is done so before this uh, we need to make sure that elastic search and Kibana is running so I've verified it both are running so let's start the log stash Logstash hyphen F and I'll give this output. Okay. Let's see if it works fine without any errors. Okay. I think uh, Twitter has started tracking the particular hashtag. Uh, let's see in from another window if uh, the index is created. Mm. I'm using the XPAC version so I'm just punching in the default username password. Good host. Okay, see here I can see uh, an index called India and I think we have only 5 count, no 73 counts as of now. Let's go to Kibana and check. I'll open one more localhost 5600 and here also it is the same elastic. Change me. Once Kibana loads, we'll have to create the index. So our index is India. Okay. Let's create this index. Okay, index created. Discover. Okay, there are 178 hits. That means the tweets, whatever is being sent, I have all the tweets, live tweets. So I can even see some Hindi tweets here. Okay, now what shall we do? We'll go to, we'll create a visualization. I'll just create a, okay, area chart on what are the counts per minute. So I'll take the x axis, uh, terms in which field is timestamp, and let's hit apply. Okay, so here I can see that for uh, every time, that is 8.15, there are 6 tweets and it's continuous same 8.15. Then it, uh, I think there is only milliseconds difference with this 18.16. So this is nothing but the count of tweets every second. So likewise I can do lot of uh, visualization uh, and even graphs. So I'll, I just wanted to look at the monitoring. So here we are into monitoring. I'll just go for elastic search, normal monitoring. So we have the search rate index latency. I think everything is uh, pretty normal because uh, we really don't, we are not overloading anything. Uh, 
likewise if I go to the nodes since this is just my test box I have just only one node I can get more info on uh, what is the JVM index system load CPU latency and other things this is just to show you what are the different uh, monitoring features available in XPAC so these are the metrics and even the HTTP connections so we can do a lot of uh, visualization and even whatever visualization we do we can create some dashboards a live dashboard uh, maybe in the start of the match itself we can create a dashboard and we can check I think uh, that's it. Thanks for watching this video.